Hello, welcome to Art and Society. I want to introduce a piece of my exhibition called About Us. This week we will look at China's Girls of Freedom. When you see this painting, please don't ask what you see, but first be aware of your own reactions. What is your first emotional awareness? What are your thoughts? Where is your attention going? To colors? To figures? To one figure? What do you think you see? Please take your time for this awareness and press the pause button. After a while, start the film again and I will tell you what I wanted to express. Your first attention is probably going to the red bars at the bottom. The skyline of a shiny city, as well as a bar graph of China's economic development. With one death in the last 12 years, the economy is growing just like the buildings. But not just that, the buildings become more and more open. With big windows, China gives us a view into their society. This development is highly driven by the one-child philosophy, a rigid and rigorous system for all families, so this family doesn't get a personal face. A remarkable result of this development is that while the buildings are growing higher, the legs of the girls in the city are getting longer and the skirt shorter. These girls of freedom show with their waving hair tresses and untraditional clothing in front of the background of ancient Kars mountains of Yangshuo that they are able to free themselves from long traditions. They could become the sun of China's future. The painting is made on PVC because plastic is characteristic for modern China. The measures of this painting are 184 by 152 centimeters. Next week, I'd like to introduce to you Dutch economic landscape. I hope you like my work. Please be welcome and look at my next week's new film. Thank you.